Hi guys, how are you all doing today? Hope you all are doing so well. Today, I'm going to be telling you seven strange behavior of a narcissist. Yes, if you see me look down, it's because I wrote them down. I really do not want to forget anyone, so that is why I am looking down. So without wasting much of your time, let's just dive in. Number one is um, seven, behavior, seven strange behavior of a narcissist. Number one is... Uh, unable to answer simple question. When you ask him or her a question, they tend to change it. They tend to change it to suit yourself. They don't do things just for doing sake. Whatever thing they do is to, they do it to please their own self, to satisfy their own self. And the second one is, hmm, they, are, they play strangers. They play strangers over their own family. You know, they have, they, because they have this behavior, they, you, you know, you always see them, they place strangers over their own family. They, be, they, do, they, they behave so nicely outside, more than people in, in their own family. They love people outside more than their own family. Have you met someone that prefer outsiders more than they, they, their own family? That is a sign of a narcissist. Yes. They want people to always praise them. They want people to always see them as a nice person. But inside their own family, they are otherwise. They don't, they don't, they can't, they are not just free with their own family. They see their family as low class. They prefer outsiders more than their own family. That is the second one. The third one is, if they are parents, you see parents that are jealous of their children. Parents that are jealous of their children's progress. Jello parents that are jealous of achievements of others if they are not parents they are people that are jealous more jealous of achievements of others they just want to be the one that are people will talk about but it's, it's so unfortunate that it can't happen that way and the fourth one is um they set rules for others they set rules for others and they set another one for you like if if they have your mind and they don't like you, they give they set rules they set, you know they set rules for rules for others, but they set another different one for you just to bring you down. These are just signs. When you see this type of behavior on someone that you know or so or, or someone that is close to you, you already know what that person is. They set rules, a particular rule for another person, and they set another rule for another person. They set another rule for you, another rules for you. The ones they're setting for you is just to, you know, bring you down. When you see this sign, you already know what that person is. Ain't definitely pushing you for something that they think that you did wrong. Pushing you to accept something that they feel that you did wrong. Not something that they know that you did wrong. Because they have this feeling that, ah, is this person that did this? They are not sure if it is you. Because they, but they feel that it will be that you are the one. So they push you to, to agree to what they feel that is right for you. I don't know if you get that. You, you are not wrong in this particular thing, but they feel that you are wrong. So they try to push you to accept something that they feel that you did wrong. When you see that, you already know who they are. They always like to walk ahead. You have this friend. You have this family member, you have this friend, you have this, you're in this relationship with this person. The person cannot walk with you. When you're walking on the streets, he always wants to walk ahead so that people will not know that they are walking with you. It's not as if something is wrong with you. It's not as if you're, you are not, not beautiful. It's not, it's not as if you're lacking anything. But they just want you to feel low so that they can feel high. When you see these signs, you already know what this person is. So it's just it's just a few just a very short video. So let me come and share with you so that when you see these signs in a person, run away. Keep your distance. Don't let anyone bring you down or lower your standard or make you feel low. No, don't ever feel low for anybody. So I will be stopping here. Remember to subscribe. If you have not subscribed, you take good care of yourself and have a beautiful and a lovely day. Bye-bye. <laughs>